Hi, everybody. So this is kind of a little hodgepodge video. Technically, we're still sort of working on Chapter 35, which is the front upper fuselage, but there's... We're working on a bunch of stuff, so... What we're going to start working on is the actual front panel piece, right? So it's not the actual panel, but it's what your panel will mount to. And there's a bunch of uh, nut plates that we need to put on. There's a bunch of... Uh, there's, a, there's a doubler, a uh, couple of doublers. And so, or, st or maybe they're stiffeners. But here I am kind of putting it on. Now, as you're looking at the side, you can see that that front upper panel takes up a, a pretty hefty chunk of the front of that fuselage, right? Which is good. I need the space for all these boxes of avionics and stuff I'm putting in. But, uh, oh, it makes working on it. It's going to be a pain. I've, I've made the final decision. I'm not riveting on anything until I've got my electrical system, etc., all in place. Here I am working on, uh, fiddling around with my little avionics shelving prototype. Uh, I've since sort of refined this a little bit. I've seen some more pictures of some ideas that I've had for this. Uh, and I'm actually going to be working on a little bit of that today. So, uh, let me see. Uh, except for that, um... The rest of the video, I'm just going to be fiddling around with wiring up one of my sticks. I say wiring. I'm actually putting uh, one of the control sticks. Each control stick has ten pins, right? Nine are going to wind up going back to the panel. One of them is going to go to the push-to-talk, right? So you've got all these different buttons and things on the, on the control stick. One of them is the push-to-talk button, right? So the push-to-talk button actually just wires directly to the microphone jack and then is grounded right so that's that's it's again that's called active low right all it really is is a grounding signal that tells the system hey the push to talk is grounded therefore the circuit is open so let's consider that to be transmitting and then you can whatever you say just you know goes out to the airwaves uh so anyway that needs to all be wired when i bought the sticks they came the wires are in place, but, like, there's no connectors, so I'm going to be uh, doing a little bit of connector work. But here you can see me fiddling around. I've got a couple of those Garmin boxes sitting, trying to figure out where the heck those things are going to go. Engine monitor, electronic controller, all that stuff. So, yep, so for the rest of the video, I'm just going to be working on this. So I've got some micro Molex connectors, 10-pin micro Molex connectors that I'm going to be using. And wiring those in. So, I uh, got a couple of questions from readers. Uh, again, Mr. Paul. Thank you, Mr. Paul. Uh, I may have answered this before, but I'm going to answer it again. Because I don't remember if the video where he's asked this has gone out yet. Paul was asking about engine delivery. Or engine ordering. I still haven't ordered my engine. Uh, I've got about, I don't know, probably three or four months until I order it. Uh, again, I'm not going with Lycoming. I'm going with a separate engine supplier. I'm not going to say who. All I will say is that the lead time for, for it is about a third of what Lycoming is at the moment. And the prices, the price difference is negligible. It's all good. So, uh, in other updates, I've gotten myself a sweet-ass little label maker. Picture that here. Uh, this thing prints on shrink wrap tubing, right? Uh, one of the things that's actually stopped me from sort of laying the cables out and getting some of the wiring for that done is the fact that, you know, you need, you need, really need to label all these things. There's, I'm not going to say hundreds, but there's, there's a significant amount of wires. And God forbid, if you ever have to, you know, take the pins out of all of one connector and start fiddling around with it, oh, oh great, I didn't have anything labeled. Well, you're screwed. You're just totally screwed. So, that label maker is going to be awesome. Actually, today I'm going to go. I'm going to start uh, labeling up some, labeling up some wires. So, uh, another news. New Year's is next week. Happy New Year's. Uh, I know this is probably like three weeks late for that. Uh, I really haven't gotten any work done lately. I've been a bad man. Uh, but there is more to come, I promise. So, thank you for joining me, everybody, and see you soon.